Now, the homeless population is one of the most vulnerable when it comes to COVID-19. And when a local college student figured that out, she found a way to make a difference. 13 on your side, Shanna Grove explains how. That's right, James. A Calvin University student decided to take her family's old discarded clothes and turn them into those in-demand cloth masks. Fresh Tori John's sophomore year was cut short like so many other students because of the pandemic. From her home in Rockford, she learned about the challenges the homeless population is facing. Greater risk of becoming sick because of crowded conditions, chronic health problems, and lacking access to care. Tori Jan decided to pull from her experiences growing up in Afghanistan to help the homeless. I didn't know what to do and I really, really wanted to help. And so um, I remember that we had a big pile of Goodwill clothes and, you know, Goodwill was closed so we couldn't take them. And then I just remembered that, you know, like growing up at home, all girls are kind of required to, um, you know, learn how to sew. And so I was like, why not use my basic skills to start making masks for the homeless? That's the least I can do. Tori John's passion for others also comes from injustices her family faced in Afghanistan. She says her parents were tortured, some of her close friends were killed, and she faced religious persecution and the Taliban shut down her school. Before her senior year of high school, Tori John moved to West Michigan and is now studying political science and pre-law. Her idea has now become a business too. She recently started an online store. We have a link to that on our website and you can go buy a face mask for yourself as well as for people experiencing homelessness. James. Thank you for that story, Shanna.